Hey y'all, hey YouTube. Today we're going to look at what's inside the Makita 12 volt max lithium ion 1.5 amp hour battery. We're going to uh, pop this baby open and see what the hell it's made of. It's kind of small. <coughs> anyway, looks like I got a uh, Torx in here. Maybe a T10 or so. Let's see what I got. I got this awesome new set there, guys. Uh, this is an Allen wrench. I don't need an Allen wrench. I need a T. Alright, I got an awesome new 3-inch set of uh, bits. It comes with Torx, Allens. I'm going to do a little video on that for you guys. And you see, this is a T10 Torx. That's nice, huh? Anyway, where's my screwdriver? Look at that, look at that. I'm going to tell you guys where I got that in, in another video that I'm going to put up top here. You know, right there. <laughs> I'm not good at that stuff, guys. And I'm going to tell you how to get this battery open. Watch out, because that clip is spring-loaded in the front. I already felt it spreading. Right. Let's put our screws up here. Don't lose them. There we go. Careful now. Alright, you see where spring is? Okay. Now we see what's in there. 18650s, looks like three of them. They're an olive green color. Hmm, I wonder who makes those. I wonder if we could get a look-see. Ah, uh, yes. There's a number on here. ZP. Let's see if we can get that in there. Maybe one of you guys will scan it and see where that battery came from. Is it, is it focusing? Yeah. Anyway, these are an olive color battery. I have to look that up to see who makes them. So we got a main board here. Small heat sink. No, that's just a, I don't need a heat sink. That's just a contactors. Maybe part of a heat sink. Yeah, doesn't really look like much to these batteries. The board doesn't really look like it has anything on it. Let's have a little uh, barcode here. Not a barcode, the other kind. And that's about it. I guess uh, Makita makes these for themselves, or somebody makes these special for Makita. I don't know. Anyway, I wanted to see what batteries were in here under the olive color ones. So. See if we can put this baby back together. And then we'll find out what kind of batteries those olive colored ones are. I wonder if they're a Samsung or Sony. Oh, put it on backwards. Side with the spring is going to go in the back here with the holes are wider apart than in the front. Okay. Okay. Basic stuff there. Let's put the battery back, back together. Alright. Alright, now we just got to put our screws in. Simple little video. See what the battery's about. This one I think you could probably fix, you know, if you have a problem with it. I think you could change one of them batteries out without much problem. Some of the uh, batteries, like the Ryobi, they got a ton of shit on them. You don't know, if, you know, once you take it apart, I mean, it's almost impossible to take it apart to begin with. But these don't look too bad. Anyway guys, that's the uh, Makita battery. 
Number BL1016, 17 watt hours, 1.5 amp hour, lithium ion, 12 volt max from Makita. Alright guys, that's going to be it for this Makita. Give us a thumbs up if you like the video. If you don't, give us a thumbs down. Leave some comments. Don't just sit there, just leave a comment. You know? I'd love to answer your comments. Good or bad. Anyway, subscribe to my channel. And we'll see you in the next video. I'm trying to straighten up in here. You know, it's a little bit of a mess, but I'm going to be getting you some better videos. And like I said, I got this new set here. I'm going to do a video about the set I got. And I got uh, some other videos coming down the aisle. Down the pipe, rather. For, uh, it, well, you'll see. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. See you in the next one.